My friends, the show is back on the road. I'm in North Carolina today at Canuga Bike Park. So I was able to wrangle a North Carolina local for this ride at Canuga. Hey, I'm a local now. <laughs> yeah, man. Five years. It's something like that, something right? Something like that. Yeah. I Maybe guess four I years. Know the area a little bit. Yeah. He's a he's a North Carolinian official. It's Seth from Burn Peak. FYI. So where do we actually go? I think we go this way. I missed the turn off. I I've never down. parked in this parking lot before. <laughs> no, they changed the whole parking lot. There was nobody there. I was like, how is there nobody at Canuga? Yeah. So how's the ankle doing? It's it's doing. I can ride okay. But what's weird is I can't really feel it. Oh. <laughs> My foot is, is sort of numbed in a weird way. That is weird. Yeah. So I'm not that confident. And if I have to bail from my bike, I honestly don't even know what would happen. Yeah. Whether it would roll. Explode. Explode. I trip a lot. Like I'll just be walking around the woods and my foot will catch a root. And next thing you know, I'm on my face. So that's going to take some time. Yeah. For the nerves to regenerate. Yeah. Little by little. Little by little. <laughs> that was my best chance to keep up with Seth, so I'm glad I got it. This is an e-bike friendly place. It is. More and more things are starting to change. Bentonville was pretty amazing how e-bike friendly everything was. They know the deal. Yeah. Self-shuttle. I actually just watched a video from the U.S. Forest Service in Lake Tahoe talking about their trials with e-bikes and seeing that class one e-bikes are no different than any other bike. And they actually found that the e-bike users pull off the trail more often because they're not worried about you yeah, know, losing ruining their, their momentum yeah, or whatever. Yeah, exactly. Getting back up to speed. Hey, it's that's like, uh, no interesting. Big deal. Yeah. So this is a blue jump line. It's right at the beginning or end. Pretty much all the trails come out here and you could either climb up that road or take another lap on Tortuga. And it's like the perfect length for just a fun jump lap. Everything's rollable, there's no doubles. Cool. It's, it's super chill. So awesome. let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> yeah. oh. oh, they changed this up. Wow. <laughs> He's back on the bike. <laughs> oh, that felt good. Yeah. I haven't been been on that in a minute. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh man. They're still getting around to cut the top off of that to make it a little <laughs> more rideable. <laughs> nice. Yeah. <laughs> Natural. That thing's only going to change and change every year. Oh, it's way different from the last time I rode Yeah. It. Man, I didn't think I was actually going to be able to get out on a ride with you for a long time. I know. Maybe once you retired. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad. No, I miss going out for rides. I really don't do it a lot. Yeah, I'm glad we made it happen. This is too perfect. Oh. I think you chose right when you chose to move to this, oh, yeah. this spot. I honestly just asked Alex what the best <laughs> place in the country was. Single track sampler approved. Yeah, so I said, okay, let's try it. If it doesn't work, we'll move someplace else. Yeah. Oh, I 
see it. <laughs> oh, get down here. I'm not really fit to lead today. Perfect. But... Nah, you're good. All right. You're going my speed. <laughs> this is the only time I'll be able to keep up. Seth at 40%. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Hold it on. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. oh wow. <laughs> that was uh, explosive. Yeah. <sighs> what a fight. <laughs> He's back. Yeah. Man, the way you whew, you went that way and not crashed, that was amazing. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm uh I was not ready for that trail. <laughs> this way for Roto Ruckus. Yeah, Roto Ruckus is definitely like a local favorite. It's awesome. yeah. If you're gonna do a blue trail, this is I don't know, I think in terms of fun potential, it's it's pretty maximum. Let's have some fun. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> that was the line. <laughs> I don't trust it. He's a maniac. He knows what he's doing. <laughs> so those kinds of berms that are super sticky and hard packed. Yeah. You, you look for that spot without the loose dirt on it. Velcro. <laughs> That's the kind of trail feature I love. The diving rollers. Yes. Oh, putting smiles on faces. You should see my smile, Brian. <laughs> I haven't been on this in a minute. Woo! <laughs> uh, awesome section. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's one of the funnest trails around. Oh, man. Anybody of any skill level can just have a huge <sighs> smile on their face from that trail. <sighs> yeah, wicked. <laughs> oh, I just messed that one up. A little detour. <laughs> it's your first time. Doubled that. <laughs> oh, that roto ruckus lap was so much fun. <laughs> yeah. I want to just do that all day. There's people who like flow trails, and then there are liars. <laughs> there are flow trails that are built by like grading companies that yeah. don't really ride bikes, and those are they get boring, but a proper flow trail, you know, built by downhill racers. Yeah. It's amazing. Pretty much anything built within the past three years, I would say, people have dialed this whole science of fun oh, yeah. into the trails. Who doesn't want to go fast and feel good? Yeah. 
Gatorade or water? Oh, I'll take a Gatorade. All Thanks, right. dog. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was fun. Lovely. Cheers, man. Cheers I'm for glad sure. Glad we made time. <laughs> it's not enough hours in the day. No, they're certainly not. That fourth climb to the top. Holy moly. I'm getting weak in the knees now. So Seth headed back. And now, chasing Sarah down. Marilyn leads the way. Oh. Chunky. <laughs> this is evergreen. Oh, that's so good. Run. This is almost more fun than that Roto one. Four climbs was enough. Was that at fourth? Yeah, I think it was four. Yeah. What a nice little place to go for a ride with friends. It was so good to see Seth and actually get to ride with him. I didn't think that day was gonna happen for a long, long time. So I'm really glad his foot was feeling good enough. He was feeling good enough. It was perfect. And if you saw his video, I was hanging out over at his house, helping to dig the berm and get things ready. Got to ride one of the trails down and stuff. It's super cool. So inspiring to see how hard that guy works. It just gets me fired up every time I hang out with him. Sarah and I got some post-ride personal pizzas from West First. Really good. Really good. Fresh, hot out of the oven. Solid. So this is just a little stopover until I hit my next destination, but I hope I will get a couple more rides in in North Carolina. The weather's looking good. It's not going to rain till a few more days, so I think I'll be able to pull this off. Until then, do me a favor. Go ride something new, and maybe I'll see you on the trail.